Friday Night Footy on Fox. Brought to you by Mazda BT50. See you shout, you guilty. No, you Boom, when you first arrived at the Kangaroos 19 years ago, there were three single fronted houses here. Now there's a cafe. Yep. What's going to be in the next seven years when you retire? The way I'm feeling right now, do I play next year? I'm hoping so. Is there a sub sub rule that I can um, you know, sit on the bench and play that Gia type of role? As He's sort of coaching as well, isn't he? He's like an assistant coach now on field. So does that happen? I'm not too sure. I, I don't like looking, and I've said this before, I don't like looking too far into the future because you get away from what you're about now. And right now I'm about helping the North Melbourne Football Club improve, helping me improve as an individual, as a player. Um, so whether that's one year, two years, now, whatever it is, I don't look too far in the future because if I concentrate on right now, I think the future will control itself because I'm playing some half-decent footy to warrant a, a, you know, a, another contract for next year. Harvey, right man, right moment! <laughs> Not Melbourne in front! Brad Scott fascinates us. He's a teaching-style coach, he's a player's coach. Has there been a different edge about him this week given the loss to Brisbane? Yeah, I think Brad's starting to find, or Brad's starting to coach how he played. I think in his first couple of years he, he really eased into it and he probably nurtured the boys a little bit. But I. That's fine with a few guys, but I think he's figured out there's a couple of guys that need to be whacked every now and then, and he certainly did that this week. And did we deserve it? Absolutely, 100%. So Brad's starting to find his feet on um, how to treat each individual differently, and uh, I think he's handled it pretty well this week. Boom, have you got an issue in the post-match, how you handle yourself? Over the last couple of years, we've seen the Rockliffe incident from the weekend, and obviously the Crowley incident last year. Your thoughts? Uh, is it a problem? I don't think it is because over 376 games, I think you said it's only happened twice. Uh, the thing is, Kingy, I'm a, I'm a competitor. I hate losing. Absolutely love winning. So in the heat of the, the moment, you do things that um, you, you can regret. I think with the Crowley thing, would have I handled that differently? Most definitely, because um, I didn't think I handled that very well. The thing on the weekend with Tom Rockcliffe, again, you can say whatever you want to me on the field. I'm pretty old school. I can, I'm a big boy. I can cop it. The timing, the timing of that wasn't wasn't fantastic. And again, it was in the heat of the battle from him and then from me to go and source him out. But what I did, mate, I went up to shake his hand afterwards and just let him know that he didn't need to carry on with all the crap after the siren. Um, I've spoken to him on the phone and after the game and, mate, as good as gold. Uh, we'll catch up at the end of the year and have a beer together. It's no dramas whatsoever. So, um, but it's hard when you're a competitor and uh, you're, you're very similar. You're very hot-headed when you play. It's, uh, it's hard to get away from. You've basically fleeced the place over the last 19 years. Next year, if they sign a contract with you, it'll probably be for match payments. It goes the other way now. Will you still sign? Two years. Can I get two years? <laughs> if it's back to the match payments for one, will you sign? But I've been on matches for about three years, I reckon. <laughs> I play at the Kangas, not the Pies and Essendon, these rich clubs. So, um, mate, I'm happy. I, it's not about. It's definitely not about the money anymore, Kingy, to, to play for this football club. Um, I've had ample opportunities to leave and go somewhere else for, um, for more money that I clearly didn't take. So uh, it's not about the money, mate. It's about playing with the boys and trying to, trying to win my second premiership and the first premiership with this, with this group.